when I listen to you talk about your training program or just about your safety culture in general is you talk about creating a strong safety program and you've always described it as a, a kind of like the, the safety culture pyramid. Would you walk us through the three pillars of the pyramid? I will. This is just something over the years that I, you know, have uh, created and, you know, it's a way of getting the message across. The first one is a culture. Uh, you know, with that, and we'll get into it a little bit more a little bit later, but, you know, a company has to have a safety culture, and they, you know, you, everyone has to understand, you know, that you do believe in safety, and that's just an avenue, of, you know, of how we do that. We just start really in the orientation and in the uh, hiring process and walk through and talk about the culture of our company. And the awareness factor is, you know, you can have a lot of uh, things going on within the company, you know, but how do you get your employees to know about the culture of your company? You know, what you believe in safety and everything else. And that's the awareness factor. If they aren't aware of it, you know, they're not going to know anything about it. So we start from the very beginning and talk about that. Uh, again, in an orientation, we communicate it to them. Uh, when they're an employee of ours, so uh, and we've uh, heavily used the uh, Infinity platform for that over the last several years. And the last part of that is accountability. And, you know, you look at this pyramid and you think about the culture, and that covers the policies and procedures. You know, who, what the roles and responsibilities are, the qualifications and the hiring, and you put all of that out. You make it make them aware of it. And then you can hold them accountable. If you don't get it out to them on a regular basis, how can you hold them accountable for it? And, you know, that's just one thing that we have always tried to do is make them aware of it, and then we hold them accountable. Uh, you know, and we do that in a lot of different ways, you know, just in uh, what we keep up with on a regular basis, what areas we're tracking, and so forth. So. 